Yes, vaccines do harm people. This woman works in the medical field. We were talking about Dr. Tenpenny's testimony about magnetic vaccine crystals. Uh, so I have a key and a bobby pin here. Explain to me why the key sticks to me. Because of the surface oils, uh, uh, surface tension. It sticks to my neck, too. I got those. Yeah, so if somebody can explain this, that would be great. Any questions? Yeah, so many questions. I'm sure you've seen the pictures all over the internet of people who've had these shots and now they're magnetized. This is Dr. Sherry Tenpenny. She's a known anti-vaxxer and you're hearing her testify in front of the Ohio State House because she was invited. They can put a key on their forehead, it sticks. They can put spoons and forks all over them and they can stick because now we think that there's a metal piece to that. Oh my God, I'm fully vaxxed. There's been people who've long suspected that there was some sort of an interface, yet to be defined, an interface between what's being injected in these shots and all of the 5G towers. It lowers your immunity and runs people down. 5G is a weapon. Hi guys, do you know what you're doing now? You're laying 5G. Yeah. So you know that kills people. Not proven yet. I mean, what is it that's actually being transmitted that's causing all of these things? Is it a combination of the protein, which now we're finding has a metal attached to it? I'm I don't know who this we is, but there's absolutely no evidence for that. How is no one laughing in the background of that video? The way she really went for it with the spoons and the 5G towers, I'm surprised everyone at this hearing had a straight face. She is likely preaching to the anti-vaxxer crowd at this hearing, but it's exactly this kind of sentiment that's so dangerous. Vaccine rates are going down, and some of it is a direct result of this kind of lunacy. Hey everyone, my name's Lisa Bernardino. Thanks for being here. The videos and pictures that she refers to, by the way, here they are. These are viral videos showing people sticking magnets onto their arms where they claim they've had the COVID vaccine. But here's the star of one of those viral TikToks explaining that all of it was fake. <laughs> oh my god. I messed up and I am apologizing. I That was a 100% joke. Stop believing things that you see on TikTok and that you see on Facebook or YouTube. Dr. Tenpenny has also said that mRNA-based COVID-19 shots may affect sperm and cause infertility. No evidence for that either. Not proven yet. Did I mention that she sells detox products online? Detox products that claim to remove things like metal from your body? What a coincidence. While detox products have been rendered just about useless for anyone with a liver. Not proven yet. Dr. Dime over here is giving ye old snake oil a go. You can find it on her website right after getting past her dedicated page to Mike Lindell from MyPillow. Because that's exactly the kind of doctor that Tenpenny is. Makes sense.